Hello everyone, it's Nini. I'm gonna do a butterfly look today. I've been wanting to do some spring looks and I saw this one on Instagram. I didn't save who it was and so I'm pissed about that. If anybody knows who this gal is, please let me know so I can give her credit. I fully believe you can get inspiration, you can um, try to replicate other artists looks as long as you give them credit. So that bugs me that I didn't write down who she was. But I'm gonna try this look. I'm going to do a blue eyeshadow look using some eyeshadows from a couple new palettes that I have. This one is from Makeup Murder. This one is from Ruby May. If you don't want to see the eyeshadow tutorial part, I'll put a timestamp where you can skip to the actual butterfly part. I wanted to pair this with a blue wig and I own about a thousand wigs and I look through them and I do not own any that have blue in them and I'm like, how is that possible? So pulled out a couple purple ones that I have and some green ones and um, I might play with them and see which one looks uh, best but yeah let me get my wig cap on and we will get started Okay, eyes are mostly done. I still have to do lashes and then the bottom eyeliner, but the lashes I'll wait until the end so they're not fluttering all over. And then the bottom eyeliner I'll wait until last because since it's on the waterline, it'll rub off in the time that it takes me to put on the butterfly. So let's get the butterfly going. I'm gonna start by outlining the butterfly with a white eye pencil. Then I'm going to fill it in with white paradise paint by Mehron. I saw this technique done by Michelle Makeup Addict. She's a friend of mine on Instagram and a lovely lady and she did this with flowers where she put down white paint and then she used shadows to fill in the colors and I thought that made them pop more and it made them blend well and so I really like that technique. Now I'm taking a black from Blue Squid to fill in the, the body and the outline of the edges. I'm finishing the rest of my face with my favorite foundation by Believe Beauty. And adding some warmth with the, the raw contour palette. I'm gonna start with this light blue undead that's in the Pop Zombie palette by Ruby May Cosmetics to start filling in some color. I'm gonna add some depth in the color with this Neo Blue by Color Drain. Adding more with Necro with the Pop Zombie palette. Now I'm going to take my trusty NYX eyeliner pen to add some details. I realized this particular one had dried up so I opened a new one because I buy these by the bulk pretty much. <laughs> I'm using that black from Blue Squid to fill in the edges and then also to add some details to the butterfly. I'm coming in with that Mehron White to add some highlights. I'm 
Taking a gray from the Warrior 2 palette by Juvia's Place to add a little bit of shading underneath. I came in a little too hot with the shadow, so I'm cleaning it up with a Q-tip and then my foundation brush. Adding my lashes. All the products I use will be listed below. And thank you so much for watching.